Hi everyone. Well, I'm off to St. Gallen today. Um, it's a city in the kind of northeast side of Switzerland. It's about two hours from uh, from here, uh, hour and a half from Zurich. And um, it's got a university and a beautiful cathedral, as I remember. And also um, there's a textiles museum there that I want to go to. And also I think there's some other art museums. So I'm going to wander, but it's starting to snow. <laughs> I'm going to jump on the train in a few minutes, but it's uh, it's actually starting to snow, so it could be quite scenic on the journey. I'll take some pictures if I see anything that's ex an extraordinary. But anyway, I just love taking these little day trips occasionally and hope that you're doing some fun things wherever you are. And uh, okay, so we're going to go to the air train station and jump on the train um, to uh, St. Gallen. Okay, just walking to the station and to my beautiful little garden here. This is such a lovely place. Well, one thing I definitely take for granted, well, one thing I really appreciate about this particular shop is it's got uh, US and uh, UK magazines, and there's always something to, to read in English, which is really challenging in Switzerland. <laughs> they have a wonderful collection, every language you can imagine. Honestly, I'm such a creature of habit. Whenever I travel, I get a magazine. I've got my uh, Real Simple which is such a treat to read. Um, I've got a cup of coffee. I have got my salmon sandwich from Springley, which I get for my lunch. And I'm gonna go up and wait for the train now. It's really raining and or sort of slushing, raining, snowing out there. It's beautiful though. Okay, this is our little Starbucks in the station. I'm gonna pop in and get a coffee, my flat white, and then head to the train. Here's my train, Zeppelin. <laughs> Beautiful trains in Switzerland. Okay, here we go, on our way to St. Gallen. Well, Swiss trains are really cool. Um, I got on the train this morning, I bought my Super Saver ticket last night, which is a really reduced fare, and then I was able to upgrade it for 12 francs to first class. So I got on the train, and um, it's not too full, but I got on this uh, like carriage, it's got like six seats in it. So it's almost like a couchette, like you could, you could sleep in here. It's amazing. It's like a cavernous room all by myself, but it's really cool. Swiss trains are just so efficient and wonderful and clean and sparkling, and they go everywhere. And uh, next stop is the um, uh, like airport, and then I'll be at uh, Winterthur, and then St. Gallen. Well, I've arrived in St. Gallen and it is snowing here. <laughs> in fact, it's been snowing for a while. There's a couple of inches on the ground. So yes, it's gonna be a fun afternoon. I'm going to look for the textiles museum. That's the first place I'm going to go. And then I'm going to find the old town and the cathedral and um, just have a wander around. It's really a beautiful little town or city and uh, I'm glad to be here. So I hope they take you around and have a little adventure together here. Okay, looking for the textiles museum. I've discovered where it is, but I got sidetracked by <laughs> this uh, little shop, which is called the Tiger Shop. It's a shop from Copenhagen and it's got all these incredible things. You puppy. Oh, a dragon. I just love this shop. It's so special. I always buy little gifts for the grandkids here, but uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Okay, after this little treat, I'm going to go to the textiles museum. <laughs> this always happens. Well, I finally found it. I found the textiles museum. Um, it's a really strange town. It's uh, it's kind of windy, but I'm heading towards the cathedral and the the, ch the sort of downtown old town area. But this is the this is the textiles um, museum. I'm gonna go inside. So I'm in the textiles museum and it's so cool. You get a ticket made out of fabric. It's very beautiful. Now I've never been here before, but I do know that this part of uh, Switzerland is very famous for its textiles. So St. Gallen area is, the, um, you know, it's the home of textile making in, in Switzerland, but uh, it's um, multimedia. There's, uh, this is a huge loom. Look at this, wow. That's incredible. And fashion, the way it was. Squeaky floors. Very, very beautiful. This is going to be fun. Okay, I'm loving it so far. 
This textiles museum is incredible. I mean, the building is beautiful and um, everything's in German, so I'll have to do some translation, but oh my gosh, I'm so happy I came, wow. I just love collage and this is amazing as you come up to the first floor this is what greets you <laughs> wow. Okay, I've just been through the uh, Textiles Museum in St. Gallen. <laughs> it was amazing. Very small museum, there's not much here except the history of the quilting and the linen industry here in this area, but the quilts. Oh my gosh, I took some pictures. Take a look at them. <laughs> They're remarkable. They must have taken them years to make these and there's a couple in particular that I just fell in love with. <laughs> Hope that you enjoyed them, this moment of culture. <laughs>well I'm just walking from the uh, textiles museum down to the uh, downtown area well it's the old town actually and looking for the cathedral and also uh, well, just what's here I know there's some beautiful little cafes and restaurants along here too it's snowing <laughs> it's snowing like crazy but it's really pretty oh, very much like Schaffhausen they've got these beautiful um, windows uh, but shops underneath them Well, it's funny, it's uh, Wednesday and there aren't too many people out in uh, the streets, <laughs> but it's, uh, it's snowing, it's beautiful, and I'm really enchanted by these buildings. They're like very much, as I said, like Schaffhausen, where the, um, you know, they actually put the shops, just left the facades above, and they're beautiful. So I'm just going to wander down here. I'll find the um, cathedral in just a minute. I know where it is. I just see some amazing <laughs> things here I want to share with you. Wow. Uh, Fountains everywhere. What is that? It's like a wooden facade. Oh my gosh, what is up? Zoom in a bit. I don't know what that is. It's quite remarkable. Outdoor cafes, not too many customers today. I'll go around. Oops, I'm on the bike. Lots of little boutique shops. It's a, it's a student town actually. It's a very big university here. And uh, so you'll see a lot of shops that sort of cater to the student community but uh, I'm going to just turn around and take some pictures of this whole set of buildings here wow okay let's start there amazing I wish I knew some of the history that I could share with you here but all I can do is show you <laughs> and there's this one here I'll get closer to it wow okay okay so this is the um facade that I saw from a distance. There's a word for these windows, I can't think what they're called, but I'll check it out and let you know. But it's so funny, it's actually above a shikari store. A shikari is like a budget fashion store, but they've got the best uh, place in town, wow. Okay, I've arrived at the uh, cathedral area. <laughs> It's really pretty. This day is gorgeous. It's very quiet in town, to be honest, and I like that in a way. It kind of suits the, uh, the mood. I'm gonna just do a complete turn around here. Okay. And hopefully you'll see the cathedral behind me. There it is. Okay. The snow is amazing. <laughs> it feels so good. I hope that you're all having a great day. You know, I'm so blessed that I live in a place like Switzerland where I could come and enjoy these beautiful places and scenes and doors <laughs> and uh, we all have beauty around us so we have to appreciate everything.
Okay, this is another entrance to the cathedral. Snow on the ground is so pretty, and the scene in front of me, wow, it's beautiful buildings, and there's something luring me towards it. Well, there's a door. <laughs> One of my favorite doors, yes. But there's something over there that says chocolate. See? St. Gallen is one of the most picturesque places I've been. These buildings are incredible. Wait for it. Unbelievable. Okay, the chocolate shop was really a little cafe, so I decided to have some lunch. I'm having a croissant with egg and a cappuccino and something called caramel. It looks delicious. Here we go. Yummy. 